Welcome to the Poor Man's Gourmet Kitchen, where we share gourmet recipes at a low budget wonder. Now check this out. Rarely do you ever get an entire fish fillet fried. What they do is they turn their blades sideways and they cut through like this. Just a slight angle, pressure of the opposite hand, and slice through halfway and then down to the cutting board. On the thicker portion, you go completely horizontal through the center, again halfway, and then down towards the cutting board. This gives you four portions to fry out of one fish fillet. First bowl you want a couple eggs and some milk. Whisk that together briskly. Now you need some cornmeal, some corn flour, some salt and pepper, which I've got pre-mixed here, and some paprika. Whisk this together as well. Now the first thing you want to do is get your fish and drop it in the egg wash. Make sure it's fully coated on both sides and then drop it right in the cornmeal mix. Work it back and forth several times to make sure it's completely and fully coated. Once you're confident it's fully coated, set it on a plate and let it rest for five minutes before frying. And to the fryer, we're going to add this to 375 degrees, and we're using peanut oil. Now space them out when you're dropping them in, so they don't overlap and crowd each other. This will allow you to get a more even fry. Now as soon as they float to the top, you can start watching the color of your fish. You want a nice golden brown, just like this. And just set it down and let it drip dry or throw it on some paper towels to absorb the oil and then serve and there you have it southern fish fry right here in the poor man's gourmet kitchen thank you for watching and be sure to stop by poormansgourmetkitchen.com for more recipes and exact ingredients